Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. I've got Manny with me once again for some this time Skellige action. Uh, how's it going, True. Manny? It's going well. It's going well, man. Like I'm excited to play this deck. Um, looking for a second deck to play because you know right now my Witcher's main and uh, you know Tragic Star is like, bro, try this. It's you know it's, it's a team deck. I'm like, okay, I'm down, and uh, here we are. Yeah, yeah. It's um, it's similar to the Froth list, but instead of Froth, you're just trying to pull off the big combo with Wolf's Bane, which seems to be uh, everywhere now, uh, along with uh, Wild Boar to Sea. So you could play Wolf's Bane, then you play Wild Boar to Sea, and it's just a huge, huge swing. Um, it, but you're still using Lippy to try to abuse uh, being able to play... Um, the Witchers twice, Witchers. and along with you could just discard Morkvarg, and you also get Roach. So that's like an 11 point play right there, which is pretty nice. Um, and then if you're searching for Lippy, you got Burna and the uh, Heimei Skulls to try and find it. And then you also got some artifacts in here to uh, try and ping some odds and evens to in your favor for the Wolf's Bane. Um, and then it also has, once again, Manny's favorite card. Gerald Wolverine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, any other, sick, dude. any other uh, things that I missed on it, Manny? Uh, uh, yes, you just gotta be careful with the skull when you're going to use the skull because you know you don't want to throw an extra Witcher and be like, ah, oh, man. Uh, same with your Lippy. Just remember, Lippy is like eleven point value. Uh, you can put Roach back into the deck, and just by using Lippy itself, will bring it out. So it's eleven point value. Yeah, yeah. You just gotta make sure that you understand that Lippy puts everything in your graveyard back in your deck. So if you start pulling a card to discard, you might end up screwing yourself and drawing something you don't want to. So um, once you transfer your deck from the graveyard, make sure you um, keep an eye on that. But other than that, it's it's pretty much similar to the uh, the Froth list, but instead of damage or buffing, you're damaging. So. It's uh, and it doesn't even have to be lane specific. It's just you got to keep them in odd and even, like the old Sahil. But mm -hmm. uh, here's some games, guys. Hope you enjoy. We'll see you at the end. Iridan. The heart of an hmm. How will we fare against Iridan? Oh Jesus! What is with us drawing all these Witchers? <laughs> I think we'll throw the Witcher first before Roach, because I believe we're gonna throw another one. Oh, we good. We can straight up open with artifact because everyone nobody's removing them anymore. Right. And iridium bomb. <laughs> oh my god, watch it. You know that that's something that is funny. It's a one for one, right? So it's not even a a kind of lost Right. Do we just kill it? With the Marauder? Yeah, and then after that we just hit the, the resolve a little bit. Aryo's been chosen. The gods speak to him. Whenever I play uh Skelly, I feel like I'm on the show Vikings. <laughs> oh, we'll save it in case we can get another bloodthirst out of it. Do we use our Tactical advantage or not yet? I don't think so because some of them run, actually run like a, a kill the lowest unit on each the, person's yeah, board. Yeah, the Griffin. That's okay. We kill it first, right? So you won't explode. Right. Now, what do we play? What do we play? Witchers, right? We don't. We're not afraid of that. Yeah, we. We should be good. God, that's so strong. Yeah, I wonder if they'll ever change it. Like maybe make their provision cost a little higher or something. I mean, like as far as uh, this goes, is actually that was pretty kind good. Of a waste. Yeah, I'm gonna nuke those. Um, 
play Burna? Uh, or do we play a pirate? The pirate needs two bloodthirst. But I mean, but like, he... that's it, right? Like, it's gonna take him a while to catch up to us. Or what? What, do, what would you like to play? I was gonna say we try to find Lippy with Burna. All right, let's do that. You stand before the Queen of Skellige. We could just discard the bear and uh, one pirate. That seems fair. No to the pirate. <laughs> He's like, <laughs> what the hell, man? <laughs> I know Captain Morgan. <laughs> oh, oh, man. He, he passed. All right. So we just got to find Lippy now. Artifact's good. Bear's okay. No discards here. Um, we look for it, right? I think we dropped. I the, think so. The pirate. <laughs> this guy. There he is. There he is. And uh, we can save the last one for the night at the end. Yeah, that's true. <clears throat> okay, so we have a couple cards that we want to play, but we want to give the artifact for a big round, right? Mm-hmm. I believe so, yeah. So we do what? Uh, bear? Yeah, bear seems fair. Fair bear. <laughs> and then we play Tra one. Uh, uh, Tragic wouldn't be proud of this moment, just saying. <laughs> um, we we'll take it first with our leader, don't we? Yeah. Um... And to whatever card we don't want to carry over. It's probably going to be something to lock, right? Damage an enemy by two. That doesn't seem like it's too crazy. Just play that. Or do we? I think we we'll just play them. Or do we play? We play. Or do we play Lippy? Because we uh, might. I. I think we play Leapy right here, right? Then, right? Yeah. Roach comes out. Yeah, because we don't have any discard right now. Like, that's the only thing that sucks. Like, if we had the, the bagpipes, the Roddy Roddy Pipers, I'd, I'd say we could wait. You know what? Like, Leapy itself is a very strong play, dude. Yeah, like, maybe maybe next time next time we'll be covering it over. Yeah, usually that's what I do, but I, if we don't uh, if we don't we draw any discard to, to draw the Witchers, you know, it's like we might not be able to make it. Uh the uh the, what's it called? We got the poet out of his, his hand though. That's that's very very good. Yeah, I'm sure he got renew or something. Something greedy. Oh. And we're out. Yep. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> we just hopefully don't draw two witchers. So our artifact hopefully will get 10 points of value. Should, yeah. And we are not afraid of Emery because we're going to probably have, going to have the longest. Oh, that's good. Um, that's really good. Yeah, I was going to say, I think we still. More than Pirate Morgan. Yeah. There we go. Okay, there it is. So we just, we just uh, spear, spear, right? Yeah, I think so. And this, we should inflict mental damage to the enemy and then he forfeits. Do we hit it? Do we? It's a two-turn um, cooldown. Yeah. I don't think it'll hurt anything. We gotta play the Witchers before we play Burna, though. Uh-oh. There's our lock. 
But we need bloodthirst, right? So we need to hit the four first, and then we lock the six. Do we lock the six or do we lock some ruin? Ah, uh, good. I good. Oh. What do we do? I think you're right. I think we lock the. I think we lock the engine. Because he can, he's probably going to use um, Whispering Hillock to eat this and make two of them. But if he's constantly able to eat stuff on this, oh, yet another one, darn it. Yeah, but this one can get wrecked. Because you're going to have two bloaters, right? Uh, yeah. So we can kill it with uh, Donna, right? So first we do the the, the spear just broke the. Right. Now we do the donor and punch him out of this existence. Calm yourselves. Let me just One punch. <laughs> <laughs> he is a pretty bad man, dude. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Oh, what do you renew? Imlareth? Um, Imlareth, I think he's not above it. So we just play another artifact. Start hitting the five. I think so. Do we just start hitting the five? Because this is three. Yeah, and then after that, it's going to be hard for him to keep up, right? Yeah, I mean, he gets two a turn. I mean, we got this bomb right here. I mean, as long as we can keep everything odd, we're just going to nuke him. You wouldn't want to hurt us, would you? There's... They're still odd. So we make... We we make this a five, All right? Yeah, and then no, I think we can make it into a three. Or he's gonna eat it. Something's gonna eat that. So then we he we make that into a four, and the other one into two. Oh uh, no, I think you got it right. I think we make it a make it a three and let him eat it. Um, do we do we charge now? Uh, this is bloodthirst three, so we got it. No, when they have two. No, it, it counts the one on the other on our side too, right? No, I don't think so. Test time. For science. I think it does. I think you could ping your own guy. No, you're right. Nope. Uh, um, and even though with that, we're in a pretty good spot. Watch it. Oh my god, he's going to explode them all. Um, I think witches first. Yeah, we play the witchers, huh? On melee? On melee. I'm in no mood to talk. Lambert's in no mood to talk. And he's like, F at range, dude. <laughs> Yeah, because we can make them into three. I I don't even know if we want to kill that because it will it will back. It comes, yeah, it comes back, back, yeah. We might see a uh, Regis here. Oh God, no! Please, no. Oh, that's a nine. That's okay. So we bring this down to a three. And hit we the play, nine. We play Burner oh, first. Let's do Burner first. Let's do Burner. We we need to start stacking the same row, right? No, it, don't, it don't really matter. And we just discard these two. And we hit. Drop nine. this down to a seven, right? Yep. Oh. 
Uh oh. The dog's not happy about it, Manny. <laughs> <laughs> He's snoozing, dude. He's a monster fan. He's like, no, nah, man. Leave my monsters alone. Oh, God, please. No rages. All right. So now they're evens. What if we kill the two? So we can make it like four next turn and we get the value back. All right. So what do we play here? Ulfadin on the the six or the five, or do we wait on that? Maybe he'll play something big. Huh. I think we just play Ulfadin. Dude, we have to super strong plays, yeah? Sure, let's go. So far, everything's even right now. And we do Wolf's Bane because this way he cannot... Uh... Oh, he's gonna be able to attack us still. Artifact compression. What did the artifact compress? Uh, let's check. Lock a unit. On the... Oh, he just brought this back up to a five. Um, so we just bring everything down to twos and use our our <laughs> yeah uh, we, we do we, that let me see we do our wolf's bane right yeah then we just hit the rest right by evens yeah oh my god that melted his board He's gonna win by this ruin. How much you wanna bet? Well, we can kill it first. Well, actually, that doesn't matter. Yeah, I don't think it matters. So we play the five, then we hit the. the... Maybe it doesn't come back on. It comes back on the end of his turn, so maybe it just disappears. Melee. Damn, dude. <laughs> that's naughty. That's, uh, that's an R.I.P. moment <laughs> right there. <laughs> he lost everything. Hey, that's the video for today, guys. Like always, thanks for watching. Manny, you got anything for the Wonderful One community? Not much. Just, you know, just uh, thank you for watching. I really appreciate your moments. Uh, you're sharing this with us. And just so you know, I wasn't saying much because, you know, I was just as amazed as the amount of points that this gives and takes. It's, <laughs> it's crazy. But, uh, you know, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. Yeah. We, we appreciate all of you. Even that one guy that downvotes every one of my videos. We, we appreciate all of you. <laughs> we'll see you next time. <laughs>